Hello everyone and welcome to another video. So today we are talking about an error that's called error socket not connected. Usually when you're on Google Chrome and you're trying to access a site, this will give you an error sometimes. So to fix it, the first step you need to do is flush your sockets. So go to a new tab and type down the following Chrome colon double slash net hyphen internals. I'll leave, the, leave this in the description and you can copy it from there. Click on enter and you'll see a window like this. Click on the sockets tab over here and you'll see two buttons. You'll see a button that's called flush socket pools. This will help you flush the sockets. Just click on it and it will be done. You'll not see any message so don't worry about it. The next step you'll not need to do is write down chrome colon double slash settings. As soon as you do that you'll see a window like this. You need to scroll down as much as possible. And you'll see an option that's called advanced. Click on advanced and you'll see more options. Keep scrolling down till you hit the end. When you hit the end you'll see two options. First is called the restore settings to their original default and second is clean up computer. So you need to focus on restore settings to their original default. So before you proceed with this step, I'll just like to warn you that after you complete this step, you'll lose all the data such as bookmarks and saved pages and cookies. So all your logins will be lost and all your saved pages and bookmarks will be lost as well. So click on restore settings to original default to reset the Chrome. And you'll see a message over here. Read it carefully. This will reset your startup page, new tab page, search engine and pin tabs. It will also disable all extension and clear temporary data like cookies. So you need to read it. If you agree, then you need to click on reset settings. This will clean up your Chrome entirely. So you'll be having a new copy of Chrome in your system and you'll have all your settings reset. So click on reset settings and it will be done. So as you can see, it will take a few seconds. And as soon as it is done, you'll see that all your websites that you were trying to access are now accessible. This will take like 15 to 20 seconds. As you can see now it is accessible. All my logins have been gone. It was it was logged in before and now it's not. So all the tabs have been cleared, all the extensions have been cleared. You can see a fresh copy of Chrome right here. So this should help you fix the error and I hope it helps. So if you like this video, click on the like button and if you are new to the channel, click on subscribe and have a nice one.